Ta da! Bye bye! Right. So we're all the way along this side now. Drop curves the other side, which are not very nice, but they, at least they work to a degree. So there's not one here, so I want if I want to suddenly change my mind like anybody else can. We can't. You just got to follow the route. And this is taking away the the flexibility which we aren't allowed to have if you're disabled and you're in a wheelchair or a mobility scooter or whether you're on crutches. Doesn't make no odds. So there's a drop curb over there because that leads into the back of the house where they park the cars. And then we've got this drop curb here which is into the um, cobbled stones. So it's a slight drop curb, but it's pretty bad as you can see. Watch. Ooh, like that. So then we come over, and this is really nice, but the reason why it's nice is because the people look after it who live here. So it's not actually a, a drop curb for mobility scooters and wheelchairs as such. Here we go again. So we're going to cross here, now at least three inches there, at an angle. So you've got to counterbalance it. Now here we are, look at this. You can see that there. You've got to lean forward so you don't tip over backwards. And then you come across. And you go down here. And it's nice, but still, again, you know, it would be nice to have a couple of drop curbs here specifically. So I'm on this side, so I want to show a look in that shop, and I can't. Because I've got to come all the way down here now. Isn't that hilarious? Fuck the council, that's what I say. Get your fucking jobs done. So we're supposed to have a um, drop curb here, but it's not. So you've got to remember to come straight. There isn't one over there to go across. And uh, here, bang. <laughs> okay. So there's not one there. Hello. Now you have to remember this is a quite a major tourist town and the three months that they have in the summer they get lots of disabled people here but they don't do anything about these pavements etc 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 So you see how high these curbs are here. It's impossible to get off one. And to imagine, you can imagine how it is, because I've sat to me once. You know, you, you move out the way of people. And you try to be as helpful as you can. And remember, the width of this is just the width of my shoulders. So, here we are. That's a little bit of a drop curb there, only because there's parking and to go across there. You get caught again. So it's it's just so ad hoc. And this is typical of a lack of care in the community by the council. Care for the council care for the community by the council. So I can't understand why one side of the road is very, very high and the other side is low. <sighs> now, look at this. They're the pimple. <sighs> that should be bright yellow for people to see. Not red because it's not a lighted. Uh, traffic stop where people, uh, cars have got to stop but uh, it should be yellow for the short uh, people who are blind and people who are restricted with sight limitations 
So we've got a little drop curb there that we use, but it's not for us. It's for the cars to get in and out of that private property. And this is typical of what goes on. You can't sort of like ignore it. But you see, this part's just been done here. And you can see where it's just been done and it's been finished off. There's so many parts. I mean, it's just ridiculous that these roads and these pathways, it's just, just terrible there. You see that? That's yellow. You see? Now, they're going to say to me, that yellow is because it's on a major route. So the other ones, like this one, they put in for two reasons, this colour. One, because they don't know what they should be doing, and two, cost. So, there we go. So we go across. So, we've got a little drop curve over there. That is only because it's an entrance into the church. We've got the major drop curb here for cars. And we've got a drop curb slightly over there, which is broken. It's not a wheelchair or anything, it's just it's just been broken. One way. My car's parking on the pavement. So here we go, we're going along here and it's quite nice. There's at times a big gradient on the pavement and you've got again counterbalance yourself. Like here we've got a warning, yeah, just here, there, see? Just slight overcorrection and you're off. Now this is an entrance into the church and this is great. See how that works? Lovely and smooth.